that's okay, because we, we didn't. I, I don't know if you guys could see, like, I grid my teeth real quick, because really thought I was going to get fucking caught there. Please tell me this freaking faucet worked. Fuck! Don't know what that triggers, but not gonna not gonna set it. Need library key, of course. Fuck is that? Bone charm. Oh, we don't have to go to the library, we have to go to the gallery. I thought that the library would be in the gallery, to be honest. Oop, shit. We've already been on this side of the fucking place, so everything, everyone's dead. Hopefully, unless it's some fucking respawn bullshit. bit. Young bitches cough. I did it, guys. No matter how savage that was, I did it. I really don't want... I need more fucking spiritual remedy. I've never had this issue. Never. Until playing fucking down. Trippy guys. Let's enter a painting. Cause that's the thing. The void. Delilah's ritual to the void. Uh, Delilah's ritual is in the void. Okay. You have many talents, Dowd, and they've served you. Delilah's talents are quite different. Okay. She creates images, but she does more. She captures spirit. She insinuates her will into her subject, whatever it is. We're witnessing her masterpiece, and perhaps yours as well. You see it now. Okay. Emily's life hangs in the balance, and Delilah's, and the fate of an empire. The end is coming, and it's been glorious to watch you throw your will against the machinery you set into motion. All things end. All things burn to ash. But you, my friend, burn bright. Okay, so we're in the void. Leap of faith. Are we playing Assassin's Creed here? Thug life!
That was an in fucking badass entrance. Dowd, have you slain all my sisters? Well, it doesn't matter. I can carry on alone at this point. I must say, I'm surprised you came this far. You're the one who gave me this chance in the first place. I thought I might see the Lord Protector pop up at the last minute. But never you. I suspect Corvo's busy. Are you doing this for Emily? Don't bother. You killed her mother in front of her and sold her to a gang of murderous crooks. You think she's fit for the throne? No. The girl Emily Caldwin will have the mind of Delilah the First, who did not inherit everything she got, but came to power through the force of her own genius. Your genius couldn't keep. Me. Oh, I think I know what you're talking. It won't save you now. Oh, who have your victims been, Dowd? Civil servants, the housekeeping staff, drunken boys on watch duty, and frail old aristocrats. <clears throat> I killed all your wishes. Your mother should have taught you not to anger a witch. I'll kill you! You're out of here. Jeez, oh. Holy shit, there's a lot of shit to take on. I got ten fucking... God damn, that's, this is a lot to take on, dude. Holy shit, we are not prepared for this. God damn it. Get Did I do it? No. You can't do this. Get fucked, Delilah. I don't understand, like... Oh, shit! Kill Delilah Cooperson. Killed her. I didn't think we were gonna make that, to be honest, guys. I thought I was gonna get fucked over right there. Target rescued, Emily. So yeah, we, we missed a lot of stuff on there, um, but I, I don't give a shit. We beat it, that's all I care. Everything is connected. Delilah's threat has ended, you made your choices, come what may. No one will ever know exactly what it took to save Emily Caldwin from a living death as Delilah's puppet. No one except the outsider, who watches everything and thinks his own dark thoughts and speaks to few in any generation. I've learned that our choices always matter. Oh, I was like, no! Somewhere. And sooner or later, in ways we can't always fathom, the consequences come back to us. I came from Circonos to Dunwall as a boy, made my living as a killer, one of the few who've heard the outsider's voice. I murdered an empress, but saved her daughter, who will one day rule the empire. Those were my choices. I'm ready for what comes. So this is the battle with uh, Corvo that we did in the main story. 
mask of my life. When I killed your empress and took her daughter, something broke inside me. Now I want nothing but to leave this city and fade from the memory of those who reside here. I've had enough killing. So my life is in your hands. Make your choice. You make an eloquent plea yeah. for a man with innocent blood on his hands. It's a shame Corvo doesn't know the real story, isn't it? How Dowd, the legendary assassin, spent his last days doing whatever it took to save Emily Caldwell. Defied the keepers of Coldridge Prison, faced down gang leaders in the terrors of Breakmore Manor. And with the end coming, you cut a savage swath through Dunwall, blood and terror for the fate of the Empire. A story never to be told. And you leave the ending up to Corvo. That's courage. You make your own choice and accept the price. So yeah, technically, you know, it, they were both kind of, I don't understand it. I don't, I don't understand how to explain it. Like, basically, uh, Dowd saves uh, Emily from uh, Delilah, but uh, Corvo in the main story saves uh, Emily from uh, Lord Regent. But still, still, man, this game all come to ruin. With the achievement I just got, Bethesda works. Man. It was a great fucking game. Yeah, that was uh, that was great. That was a great game, and I'm glad that I, I did the playthrough of this uh, for the channel. Um, holy shit, guys! So that is literally it. Um, as I said, I'm not going to be doing the uh, Dumbwall uh, City Trials because all it is is kind. Of, I'll show you what it is. Uh, I'll, I won't do it. Um, but yeah, it's basically just challenges and stuff like that, as you can see. Uh, yeah, I just I don't see the point in it. It doesn't hold any uh, story elements to the game. It doesn't, you know, make us scratch our head at anything. It's just kind of like, can we see if he's, you know, good enough to be stealthy or anything like that? And I, as you guys know, I'm not fucking good at doing that. So um, I would like to thank you guys so much for for coming out and supporting this uh, series that I've done here. I think it's took me I think 13 and a half sessions because I had to split up this last session uh, because of you know fucking up and not remembering the password uh, that was given to us by the old man. Um, but yeah, I will be starting my new series uh, right after this, which is going to be South Park: The Stick of Truth. Actually, on 553, a community member of ours, uh, an alpha. Um, hooked it, hooked me up with, uh, hooked me up with the game, so I'm going to be doing a playthrough of that, which is going to be fucking amazing, uh, it's going to be a lot, uh, less intense, and like, uh, it's going to be more comical and stuff like that, um, so, again, thank you guys so much for watching this series, I love you all, and I hope to see you guys, um, on everyone else's videos as well, and I'll catch you guys later, PEACE!